Hello, my name is Amir Hussein Jamalian. I am an electronic engineer. This session I want to talk about new pneumatic equation y equal a plus b plus c plus a minus c minus b minus for simulating this equation i use four different softwares as you can see float sim pneumatic version for simulating the pneumatic circuits as you can see and plc inputs and outputs wiring Tia portal for simulating the PLC programming language. As you can see, this is the graphset language. Factory IO for simulating the production lines. And PLC SIM for simulating the PLC inputs and outputs. They are connecting together and working together simultaneously with EZOPC. Okay, first I describe each software step by step. You can see on the Floyd C pneumatic version the pneumatic circuits as you can see cylinder A, B, C, and this is the soccer D. You can see the directional control valves, they are the pneumatic directional control valves and a special 5-3 with the springs and solenoid directional control valve this is the 5-2 pneumatic con directional control valve with the spring and solenoid and this is the 5-2 directional control valve 2 they are the PB valves and this is the 2 2 pneumatic control valve with the spring and solenoid with the normal close at the normal mode. This is an special cylinder with two shafts flow control valves. This is a double acting cylinder and this is the double acting cylinder 2 flow control valves this is a suction section a special vacuum valve this is an air filter this is a soccer and this is a special differential pressure switch it works because of two P1 and P2 pressure. The differential between two pressure and it works because of the soccer suction. I will describe it. On the other section, you can see the PLC wirings, inputs, and outputs. I will describe it. You can see this is a diffuse sensor one or this one connected to the I1 or I0.1. I in this circuit I don't use I0.0. And you can see we can use the inputs from the other numbers. The other input you can see this is the proximity magnetic switches A0 connected to the I2 or I0.2 you can see A1 connected to the I3 or I0.3 A0 and A1 mounted on the cylinder shield cylinders A this is the situation of the A0 and the other side this is the A1 at the end and the front of the cylinder you can see the proximity magnetic switch B1 connected to the I4 or I0.4 this is the location of the B1 magnetic switch it mounted on the cylinder's B shield 
and this is the proximity magnetic switch C1 connected to the I5 or I0.5 this is the location of the C1 mounted on the cylinder C shield and this is an a special differential pressure switch between pressures P1 and P2 connected to the I6 or I0.6 this is the pneumatic symbol of the differential pressure switch and this is the electrical symbol of the differential pressure switch on the input okay they are the inputs and the wiring and you can see on the PLCC on the input section from I0.0 .0 to I0.7 okay let's see the outputs from the Q0.0 .0 to Q0.7 solenoid valve Y1 connected to the Q0.0 .0 or Q0 you can see the Y1 the action is A plus Y2 connected to the Q1 or Q0.1 the action is A minus Y3 connection connecting to the Q2 or Q0.2 the action is B plus Y4 connected to the Q3 or Q0.3 the action is C plus and finally the Y5 connected to the Q4 or Q0.4 and the action is sucker going to suck the devices or the pieces off on the production lines I will describe it on this simulation this is the output section on the PLC scene from the Q0.0 to Q0.7 or Q0 to Q7 okay let's I describe the factory IO you can see an special two axis pick and place devices a pusher and this is the DFU sensor look from closer view this is a DS1 as you can see DS1 connected to the I1 or I0.1 this device working as the pieces detector and after detect the pieces the A going to be A plus and this is the pusher this is the cylinder A as you can see okay this is the sucker mounted on the cylinder C you can see the sucker these devices devices D okay let's see the cylinders B this is the cylinders B A plus pardon B plus B minus you can see B plus B minus and this is the cylinder C C plus C minus C plus C minus and I will told you this is the soccer pieces the device D okay let's see how this simulation works you can see eight different steps from S1 to S8 and the transition from T1 to T8 and after it jump to the step one again and this is the closed loop working again and again okay I will describe it for you and let's start the simulation you can see 
detector detect the pieces A plus B plus C plus A minus C minus B minus now this on the cylinders this is the cylinder E A plus B plus C plus a minus C minus and B minus A plus as you can see this is a special stunt two shots you can see how this soccer work a plus, B plus, C plus, sucker turning on, suck the pieces, and place it. You can see the steps. It's one, it's two, it's the three, it's the four, it's the five, it's the six, step 7 and finally step 8 and going to the first step okay this is the simple explanation of the equation y equal a plus b plus c plus a minus c minus b minus let's say some describe about the soccer and how the differential pressure switch work I use this special pressure differential pressure switch because of the simple one doesn't work with the minus vacuum and the support of this range because of the difference between the main pressure and this is the sucker pressure this switch turning on and I will show you let's see now this sucker working as you can see this is the pneumatic going out to the air and because of the venturi theory this sucker sucked the pieces from this place and when the question is when this special and special special switch work I will show you imagine this sucker sucked the pieces okay this is the pieces and the sucker socket you can see this pneumatic switch because of the differential between difference between two pressure this is the minus pressure and this is the plus pressure this is special switch working and the output of this switch going to be on and connected to the I6 let's I show you again release the pieces and again suck the pieces notice at these pressures they are working on the bar measurement 5.89 and minus find zero <coughs> excuse me and again okay let's going back to the simulator first and this is the second okay and let's see the simulation <coughs> thank you very much for your attention Please feel free to ask me your question and your suggestion. You can see my LinkedIn group.
with more than 220 simulation and educational pictures of course and my youtube channel for more than 145 simulation too thank you and bye